four side. No funny business. No funny business. How's Shorely treating you? Good. Great. Good luck and good evening. Yes, I know that's where we met, but... What sort of party are you hoping to have tonight, Commander? I could set things up for quiet conversation, or would you prefer a more energetic evening? I think it's time to blow off some steam. Excellent choice, Commander. Allow me to queue up a series of popular nightclub tracks and drink lists. I will also modify my appearance to be more festive. Hey, come on in. Thanks for coming. Thanks for the invite. Make yourselves at home. Thank you. Happy to be here, Shepard. This what humans call a party? Not if I can help it. Hell no. Give it some time. 
Shepard. Hey, Shepard. You gonna have a drink? Sure. How's everyone doing? Ask me after ten more of these. Booze and Krogan. This should get fun in a hurry. I've never seen a Krogan drunk before. Like, really drunk. They're just as ugly and twice as loud. I'm kidding. Shit. You all need to lighten up. Yeah. yeah I suppose we do. Thanks for doing this, Commander. I know I needed a little R&R. &R. I think we've all learned to rest. That we have, Cortez. Here's to taking a damn break. Hey, James. Got a minute? Sure. What's up? So... What's it gonna take for you to see me as a woman instead of your commander? Seeing you as a woman isn't the hard part, Commander. Believe me. See? Such a flirt. Just knock it off and answer the question. Uh, I don't know. It'd take quite a few drinks and one of those once-in-a-lifetime nights. I'm certainly tempted. Should I roll? James, glad to see you're coming around. Glad to see I'm what? I should probably mingle. I'll find you later. You know why Cerberus is gonna lose? Demographics. You recruit a guy who's 20 and got no life, he'll work his ass off for the cause. But do you see any old people in Cerberus? Any families? No. There's no future in a terrorist group. And sure, they pay, but you ever bring up vacation time? There was a brick wall. How about you, Joker? How would you turn Cerberus around? I'd make Cerberus... You know, I miss the days when Cerberus was just hilariously incompetent. You know, when Jacob was in charge. Excuse me? What specific time period are you referring to, Jeff? Hey, Commander, this is Cerberus. We were studying some Rachni, and they got loose and killed all our guys. Can you take care of that? It's one system over from where we hooked some guy up to the Geth, who then got loose and killed all our guys. They did rack up quite a body count. And at least back then, it was usually their own bodies. We knew some cells were bad, but the Alliance and the Council weren't doing anything. And we were doing good work. And crunches. Lots of crunches. Hey, not okay, Kasumi. True. However, Cerberus did successfully revive Shepard from a near-death state. And after taking down the Collectors, I cut ties with Cerberus, got loose, and started killing all their guys. For which we thank you. Jeff, do you remember that I am also a Cerberus project? Oh, crap. Edie, up for some bad examples of human behavior? I think you mean examples of bad human behavior. Just a hint. Grammar correction? Not the best icebreaker. Hey, Commander. Weird to see everybody here together. You think? Well, weird, but good. Nice to know it's not always arm wrestling reapers with us. Anyway, thanks for putting it together. I'll try not to be too embarrassing. Thanks for inviting me, Shepard. It's nice to see you like this. How do you like the new crew? You always attract the best. Have fun. You bet I will. I can't get over the size of this apartment. The electric bill alone could have paid for my college tuition. Or funded the war. Or made a nice down payment on one of those Atlas mechs. Always one in one. Or put an air conditioner in this suit. You have no idea how hot it gets. Or purchased a time machine so I may escape all these primitives. So, Shepard, you can serve this swill, but can you drink it? Someone has to drive y'all home. Are we sure the Normandy is still there? Has anyone else tried to steal it? Stealing the Normandy? Now there's an idea. Wait, what? Who? I see you, Primitive. Which of us has four eyes? Trainer, you still have your toothbrush? We can always get another Normandy. Call up the Cerberus and ask them to please build us the SR3. 
But wouldn't that require you to change your name? Tali Zora von Normandy SR3. It's Vas Normandy. <laughs> von means one who has a weak bladder, which feels appropriate right about now. We've seen a lot of good times on the old girl. That we have, indeed. Here, here. Some of you more than others. I'm just honored to have squeaked in. To the Normandy. And to squeaking in 50,000 years later. Hi. I'm trying to socialize. I'm not particularly good at it. Not much for big parties. Well, if I know people, sure, but some of your friends are legends. I can't just ask if they've tried the hummus. Also, Dr. Chuckwas apologizes for not being here. It's some emergency medical consult on the Citadel. She sent some fancy liquor, though. It was great. Wish you could have had some. This is nice. I don't spend much time with everyone like this. As friends, I'm glad we could do this. In my cycle, too many people in one room risk a high casualty rate if attacked. We should all be careful. 50,000 years from now, no one will remember this party. What is the point? Beware. Something called a Kasumi is on the premises. It pretends to be invisible. Foolish primitive. Nothing escapes these eyes. Your guests appear to be getting rowdy, Commander. Would you like me to change the intensity of the atmosphere? The party's just starting. Let's turn it up. At your service, Commander. Hang on, wait. I heard there's a big party in there. Can we come in? <laughs> no, you can't. How's it going over here? You can't come in. It's going good. I see that. Anyone interesting trying to get in? Not really. No. Get lost. <laughs> no. Can I try that? Sure. <laughs> Press this button and say no. Uh, no. Great work. Oh, good. Thanks. No. See? Easy. Keep up the good work. Will do. I told you already. No! Yes, I like pie. And no, you can't come in. Hey, Shepard, thanks for the invite. Never been to a human party before. I've had lots to drink. And look at me. Still standing. <laughs> Ever seen a Krogan drink so much they get sick on your floor? I'm here to make sure that dream comes true. I can stop bullets with my mind! You guys, I love you guys. No, no, listen, okay? No, no really. Okay? Worst planet to get shot down over? We're talking pre-war? Pre-war, life-bearing worlds only. Hey guys, talking shop? No worries, this is fun for us. So, you don't have a sidearm under your pilot's chair? The weapons locker is on the bridge, practically right there. A weapon you can't get to is no weapon at all. When's the last time you trained with a handgun? Sometime before I got the ass-kicking robot as my co-pilot. That's no good. What if you have to save Edie someday? Unacceptable. You should always train. Pilots are warriors, too. Exactly. Some range time will fix you up. Right, Commander? You are not taking me shooting. My testosterone levels are plenty high. I fly a deadly war machine, remember? Joker's body count is plenty high. You don't need to take him anywhere. 
This is not about me knocking Joker. This is about being prepared for the worst. Man, I didn't hear of any gunplay when Rex grabbed your shuttle on Sir Cash. If there had been, I'd have killed our best shot at an alliance with the Krogan. More likely, you'd have just pissed it off. And maybe we should drink. To brains as well as guns. Done. Hey, I was uh, talking to James earlier. He was conflicted. It was kind of sweet, actually. Oh, yeah? He said there was something heating up between you two. I hope he's right, because you deserve each other. I, I mean that in a good way. Thanks. I guess we'll see what happens. we do. We're both hunters, right? I suppose we are. And? And, well, and we're both good looking. Hello, Shepard. Zaid was just keeping me company. Hello there. You're admiring the art? Beauty, as they say, is in the eye of the beholder. Hey, Shepard. Hey, beautiful. What do you think, Samara? Hang on, hang on. Don't get all snooty on me. I didn't say I didn't like it. I do like it, actually. If I'm completely honest, I'm not sure what it is. I like the way the colors blend, and the depth of the... Actually, I have no idea what I'm saying. It makes me feel uneasy. Like when you're alone in the dark, lying in wait. And the cold wind brushes across your face like the kiss of death. Huh. You are a complicated individual, Aid Masani. You bet your sweet Asari ass. Specialist trainer, may I ask you a question? You could ask me anything, Evie. What's wrong, you two? I am asking Specialist Trainer about why she found my voice sexually attractive. This is a really good cheese, Shepard. I put some in through the filters. Is it organic? On one occasion, you said that you wanted to, quote, pin my voice against the wall and run your tongue along its collarbone. Well, uh, there's a context there, but... Absolutely. Biotics are impressive. I'm not saying they aren't. You're just saying that they're not that impressive. I'm not saying anything. I'm just saying. Ugh. Hey, what's going on here? Everyone playing nice? Of course, Shepard. James was just explaining how physical conditioning trumps biotics. Really? You going there, James? Commander, just listen. Biotics are strong, but unpredictable. All that cooling down. Shepard, where did you find this guy? I wouldn't call my biotics unpredictable. I don't think the Reapers would either. A person can improve their physique, but biotics, they are what they are. And what about our poor friends stuck with flawed implants? Wait, what? You're not talking about me, are you? <laughs> I mean, I may be L2, but I've worked very hard. And now I can read. Really? That's... no. Really? Huh. That's a bit strange. Okay, okay. Maybe it's not conditioning exactly. Maybe it's just the condition of one James Baker. Check it out. This guy here never has to cool down. In fact, the hotter, the better. Wait. We're still talking about combat, right? Hilarious. Just hush and do some sit-ups. Kasumi. Just looking. <laughs> Ugh, goddess. I'm gonna have to go with James on this one. Oh, thanks, Shepard. Biotics are a little intangible when there's an example of physical excellence standing in front of you. Nice. Great. Now we'll never hear the end of it. 
First questionable decision I've seen you make, ever. Check it out. I can also roll my tongue. Oh, my. That's... Shepard, if that's your decision, I support you. Always. James, please stop doing that. Hey! <laughs> need me to do anything? Uh, food run, change the music, check on ice. I need you to relax and have a good time. Okay, you're the boss. Uh, hey, maybe I'll cook something. Caden, just relax. Your guests appear to be enjoying themselves, Commander. What shall I do now? Maybe you should check on your boss. I think she's involved in a competition upstairs. I will locate Dr. Tassoni right away. It is customary to dance with friends or loved ones. Would you dance with me? It's going to take a lot more than a polite request to make that. So he won't dance with you, huh? Hello, Shepard. He will not. Well, I will. <laughs> Seriously, though, don't go there. Well, then maybe you should dance with her. Other people are dancing, Jeff. Yes, they are. And I am sitting here enjoying my drink. Joker. No. Come on. No. Seriously? Ugh, fine. Dancing during wartime wastes precious energy. Can't dance myself. I move like a greased one. Here you are, Commander. So here's where the party's at. Goddamn right. Come to hang out with the popular kids, Shepard. Easier to talk back here. What do you think of the music? Great? Bad? What? Not as good as in your cycle, eh, Javik? Am I right? Not even knew it. Are there more of these beverages, Commander? Sure. Absolutely. I will look for one later. These are the best things I've had since this. <laughs> you should bring out those moves more often, trainer. Captain on deck! Has she always been like this? Shepard is saving the galaxy. You have to forgive a few eccentricities. It's very enthusiastic. It is impressive. We should record this and broadcast it for the Reapers. They'll either run away, melt down, or fall in love. <laughs> Good to see some things don't change. Well, I like it, Commander. It's good to see you cut loose now and then. Thank you for all your loyalty and support. One hundred and sixty. Seventy-five, seventy-six. Shepard, what's up? Just demonstrating a little physical supremacy. But can you do that with a drink and a snack in each hand? Sure. Ugh. 
Wow. <gasps> Why is Caden lapping you? Don't act so surprised. Seem a little slow tonight, James. Well, nobody's perfect. How's it going on your end? <laughs> okay, now. Let's find a more fun way to get sweaty. Come on, let's dance. James, how are those drinks going down? And by how, I mean almost done. Commander, I mean, I should say, Shepard. Yeah, I'd say this is beginning to look like a once in a lifetime sort of night. Nice. I'll see you later, James. photo to remember this. Arrange yourselves on the sofa. An excellent suggestion, Shepard. Great idea. I want a copy. A photo with primitives. How charming. Thanks for coming, everyone. Here's to us. Ready, Glyph? Of course. If you could all please direct your attention this way. Okay. Everyone say Normandy. Normandy! Normandy. this to anyone commander really tell you what i won't bring it up as long as you get your ass out of bed and make me some eggs deal did we uh, break anything last night I don't suppose you need anything around here. Calibrated. Was someone making tea? I could use some tea. Shepard! I was just going to lift some weights. Wanna join? Hey. You look like shit. You know the best part of an overcharged biotic amp? No hangovers. I feel fantastic. How about everyone else? I think I broke my head on something last night. Bathroom is all cleaned up, Shepard. Good as new. Shepard. Shepard. Now that was a great time. There's coffee. Who wants coffee? I want coffee. More coffee? Am I being... Okay, who wants eggs? Liara, eggs? Shepard, good to see you up. Hope I didn't wake anyone up with my snoring. I go like a buzzsaw since I got my nose broke. Hey, Commander. Hell of a night. I've managed not to throw up. So, last night, I didn't do anything, did I? 
I'm checking extranet sites. No hits yet, so maybe I just... Shepard, good morning. to the galaxy now? Kneel before Javik. I had a dream. Fifty thousand years had passed. It was horrible. I was alone. Primitives had evolved. They ruled the galaxy. Solarians, Turians, and the Asari. I was one. The Ara. She had those eyes and that voice. She was blue. No, no, it was just a dream. Oh, I smelled primitives. Oh, it was no dream. Shepard. I hope you slept well. Some neighbors came by last night to complain about the noise. I put their bodies in the building incinerator. That was a joke. I have nothing else to report. Duty calls, huh? Even with a hangover? Yeah, there's still a war on. Unless the Reapers are on shore leave, too? I'm guessing they're not. Round everyone up, pass out the aspirin, and have them report to the Normandy. You got it. Game on. At least we threw one hell of a party. Probably the last one. My well, last one until you finish kicking the Reaper's asses, you mean? Because that's the plan. Can't wait to see what the hell you make us do next. It's been a good ride. best.
Commander, Dr. Chakwas sent word that she'd like to speak with you down in the med bay. Shepard, remember our agreement? We'd open a bottle of Cerise brandy every year, and it's my turn to buy. But it hasn't been a year yet. Yes, well, something tells me we won't have the chance a few months from now, so... indulge my impatience. You grab the glasses. I'll open the bottle. And Jeff says, Jack, Jacqueline, subject zero, is sorry. But it's man to me. I'd like to keep my Admiral Winky. Oh, Shepard. You know, I just realized. You've never called me by my first name. Well, neither have you. And I never will. You are Commander Shepard. Hero of the Citadel. Conqueror of the Collectors. Savior of the Galaxy. Using your first name just disrespects everyone you're fighting for, alive or gone. <laughs> that makes no sense. Consider it a lady's prerogative, then. Come, let's have a toast. To a woman I respect and admire. I'm lucky to have you with me, Doctor. And to you. It's my great honor to share this journey with you, Commander. And good fortune to us all. I've learned my lesson this time. Even a Krogan couldn't match you drink for drink. Parts of the chunker reminded me of the desert back home. The lizards and worms are bigger, but, you know, the sand and everything. Three hundred years it took to take back the quarry and homeworld. I sure as hell hope it doesn't take that long for us. I'm ready to see Earth again, Shepard. <laughs> 